Come on, Bart. Leap into your father's arms. Come on, just like the old days. I'm too big now, Dad. There's no way. Come on, boy. Leap. Do it. a boy. Come on, Bart. You call that a leap? Dad, why are we doing this? You've always been afraid of falling on your head ever since you were a little baby. I'm trying to help you overcome that fear. You want me to jump? Because I've always been jumpy. <laughs> That's a good one, son. Always been jumpy. <laughs> Dad, this is really dumb. My head still hurts from the last two times. Let's go, boy. No excuses. I want to see some gumption. Leap. Leap, boy. Leap like you'd never, um... Leap like you never... What's the past tense of leap? Leapt? Leaped? That doesn't sound right. Well, what do you know? Leaped and left. They're both right. But, Dad... I haven't got all day. Now leap and give it all you've got. Do I have to? Art. I'll get it. Good news, son. The boxing gloves have arrived. Mm. Hey there, boy. Mom took the girls to the ballet tonight. So it's just you and me, kid. Uh, sure, Dad. So set up the TV trays and let's get started. You want the frozen fish nuggets or the pork Well, it's a toss-up, Dad. I got an idea. Let's mix them together smorgasbord style. <laughs> Voila! Fish pork aroni a la Simpson. Uh, Dad, would it be too late for me to catch a bus to the ballet? Where'd he go? Bart! 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 Here I am. Eat. Yuck, tastes like dog food. Bart! Does eating dog food turn you into a dog? Bart! Well, that answers that question. You're not touching your fish pork nuggets a boy. Whoops! Dropped my fork. <laughs> Finished already? Mmm, lick the plate clean. Good, because there's plenty more where that came from. <laughs> We're home. The ballet was divine. Oh, it was just a... What's that smell? Oh, look at that. Our own two husky men snuggled together on the couch. Oh, really Pass that bucket of fish pork and nuggets around this way. Come on, man. No nuggified fish porklets. Oh, Isn't no. that sweet? How come you're always wearing that hat? Fashion statement, Dad. Take off the hat, boy. Look, he's a beatnik. <gasps> you go get a haircut. Right now. I was afraid this moment would come. Well, what'll it be, Sonny? Just a little off the top, sir. Ah, uh, sure thing. There you go. What do you think? What the hell did you do to my head? Oh, well, that'll be five dollars, please. And here's a sucker. <laughs> Isn't that boy back from the barber yet? I heard him sneaking around in his bedroom. Bart! Front and center! I'll take it off, but you all gotta promise you won't laugh, okay? Promise? We, we promise! promise. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> Wanna hear a scary story? Once upon a time, there was an evil insane maniac. Bart, why can't you tell the story with the lights on? Okay, you little babies. I can't find the light switch. It's gone! Everybody comfy? 
Once upon a time, there was a psychopathic strangler on the loose in a dark house. They couldn't see him, but they could hear his breathing. It was dark. All was silent. And then they heard it. The sound of the crafty vampire sucking blood from the neck of his latest victim. Listen. <laughs> and now for the scariest story of all. Once upon a time, three little children sat shivering in the dark. Suddenly, they heard footsteps. Listen, you can almost hear them coming closer and closer and then the footsteps stopped bark, bark. uh oh chores the toy chest the closet safe at last oh no it's locked I'm trapped in here. Trapped like a rat. Help! Help! Bark! Uh-oh. Dad'll hear me. Help! Help! I gotta get out of this closet. Maggie! Maggie! In here! In the closet! Maggie! Go! Get! Help! Maggie! Come on, man! Do what I'd do if I were in your place! I can't take it anymore. I've got to get out of this closet. I give up. I'll do chores. Huh? Dear Bart, the family has gone out for frosty chocolate milkshakes. Sorry we couldn't find you. Love, Dad. Can we have an advance on our allowances? No, you can't. Ah, uh, come on, Mom. We're dead broke. I said no. Now, while I'm out shopping, don't get any funny ideas about filching cash from the money jar in the kitchen. Oh, yeah, the money jar. Promise me you'll be honest. I promise. I hereby solemnly swear. Okay, bye. Be good. This is wrong. Go on, Lisa. Get the money. Remember your promise, Lisa. Maggie! Go for it, dude. Get the moolah. That's right, Bart. Steal the bread, man. What? That's it, a measly butt? Can't even trust your own mother. Now play friendly, children. But we don't want to play friendly. Bark! We want to play rough. Lisa, act like a lady. Yeesh, what a grouch. Come on, Bart, you can punch better than that. Let me try. But you're a mere girl. And you're a sexist pig. Give me the gloves. Your problem is you're not motivated. What, dear? It's a punching bag. They're just playing, Homer. I can't sleep with that racket. Go tell them to knock it off. I like the punching bag sound. You go tell them if you don't like it. I said do it. Now move it. Mm. Why, you little... <gasps> oh. Uh-oh. Sorry, Dad. Sorry, Dad. Sorry, Homer. Sorry, Homer. Get out of the way, Bart. But... Step aside, boy. But... Bart. Let go, Lisa. Don't! Oh, boy. After all these years of watching Krusty the Clown on TV... We finally get to meet Krusty the Clown in person. You know, I base my whole life on Krusty's teachings. Wow. 
the glamorous world of TV. <laughs> oh, you gotta be kidding. How can they expect a genius like Krusty to work in a dump like this? Hi, boys and girls. Come on, boys, the Krusty the Clown Show. <laughs> Krusty sure looks different in person. No way is that Krusty. Krusty's a real clown. That's just some lumpy old dude in a clown suit. And Chunky the Pig. But first, let's pay a visit to some of Krusty's loyal kitty cadets. And what's your name, little girl? And what's your name, little boy? I'm Bart Simpson. Who the hell are you? <laughs> Why, I'm your old pal, Krusty. Oh, yeah? Then what's Krusty's secret motto? Uh, oh, instead of feeling sad and blue, keep a Krusty smile on you. Listen, pal, I don't know how you found out Krusty's secret motto, but you're still an imposter. <laughs> Kids in TV land, you're being duped. Why, you little... <laughs> Family therapy? What the hell is this? You said we were going out for frosty chocolate milkshakes. Well, I lied. Uh, Simpsons? Welcome. So what brings you to family therapy? Well, Doc, it's like this. They're all driving me crazy. I don't know what to do. Oh, my show is an orphan. Lisa! Oh, boy, mince. Go ahead, take one. We never laugh anymore, Doc. You can say that again. When Homer's right, he's right. For once, the old man's correct the rooney Shut up! I'm sensing some deep-seated hostility here. Why don't we all take a deep cleansing breath? <sighs> don't you think you've had enough mints, son? I ain't leaving till that bowl's empty. Put those mints back, boy. Blech. Good lord, you little slob. You ruined the whole bowl. Don't talk to my brother like that, you big oaf. Oh, why, you little borderline psychotic. Oh, talk to my daughter like that? Oh, yeah? Now you're going to bully me like you bully your kids? We don't like you, sir. Mm. <gasps> Leave this office, please. Ha, 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 ha,